I bring in new business for our company. I used to anyway. I was good at my job. I, I needed to be. We weren't a large company. People relied on me. I had this overseas deal. Big government contract. It was close to completion when the agent mentioned we needed to pay a local tax. It seemed like a small price to pay to close the deal. Did I know I was breaking the law? Yes, but I thought the benefits outweighed the risks. And my bonus relied on it. They never talked about it in the office, but they knew. I never thought about the 6am police search of my house. I never thought about going to court. I never thought about having to pack a bag in case they don't let me come home again. I'm always telling my kids to think about the consequences of their actions. What must they think of me now? He was great with clients, you know. I couldn't believe it when I heard what happened. He was a good guy. He generated the business. Sure, I'd heard rumours about bribes to secure contracts, but... I remember when the police arrived at the office. They took paperwork, copied the office server. They even searched his desk. Who told him? Competitor? Someone in the office? The bank? What do I say if a client calls? Is my job safe? I process those invoices. I built this firm from the ground up. Now this, it's just the way they do business over there. It was either that or lose the business. What could I do? Felt like the police were everywhere, searching the office, asking me questions. How do I face everyone? What do I say? I don't know if we can recover from this. Why didn't I stop it? We rely on him for everything. It was awful. Six in the morning they came. The plane closed in full the neighbours. I could see the curtains twitching. Then came the story in the local papers. How can I explain this to the kids? What about their exams? How are they supposed to carry on with other kids and parents whispering about their dad? If he goes to prison, Be the same person when he gets out? Will I? The night before a search, I always think about the suspect and what they're doing right now. Watching TV, putting the kids to bed. If they only knew what I knew, all their plans for the future ruined. We try to be discreet when we're at the house, but it's almost impossible. Presiding over these cases is never easy. Often the accused are of previous good character. 
you and the other defendants occupied trusted and respected positions within the company, which you tarnished through negligence and corruption. The consequences of your offending have been grave. It may well be that you find it difficult to ever work in this field again. I sentence you to five years imprisonment and make a confiscation order against you. Court is adjourned.